Hello everyone, welcome back to Mod Review. Today we will be taking a look here at lots of new mods. I've moved the Mod Review series here to the Mills County map. All of the mods are public and the link to the post on my website will be down below. Up first we'll be taking a look here at the all new Tesla Cybertruck, the fully electric pickup truck. In the store this can be found under the cars category. It has a starting price of $31,000 here with 215 horsepower and the interior seats are color changed. Well now for the one shown today, I did decide to go with white. Full white leather looks so so sweet. Now you do have a few options for painted dash, marble dash, and then you could also get the cover for the bed. Uh, next up here you, you do have a few attachments here which is pretty awesome. Even a gooseneck, even a snow plow if you want to see this thing pushing snow. Finally you do have the rear wheel drive or the all wheel drive motors or the tri motor and this is as realistic as I I've seen the uh, pickup truck. As we take a full walk around, you guys can see it is pretty sweet. Now, I do remember watching the launch event here on this. I am a big fan of these Teslas. Uh, they are just so cool. Zero emissions. They're very silent. And the Cybertruck has a very unique design. Once we hop here on the inside, uh, top speed 192 miles per hour. Let's see if the lights do work here on it. Looks like, uh, let's see here, we don't have any uh, straps. Looks like none of the lights do work here. And we do have a working tailgate. Really quickly, let's put the tailgate down there which is pretty awesome and hopefully there is collisions now on the first person view you guys can see we do have a pretty detailed view uh, with the uh, dash look at this thing this is so sweet here now this doesn't actually have a steering wheel uh, this is awesome one of the uh, coolest trucks I will have to say that's in farm sim and it does have a pretty realistic acceleration really quickly on this back road here let's see if we could rip it really quickly now Tesla's uh, being full electric have instant torque oh yeah that is pretty realistic Wow, that is awesome. I'm really excited to be back here featuring some mod reviews here for all of you guys. I'm trying to do one every week, and lately there have been quite a few mods that haven't released. Now, I will uh, be linking the post to my website down below. I now put all of the mod links on my website. I find it a little bit easier, and you guys have been really liking that as well. But wow, pretty awesome. Really am excited. And now, this will be coming to a few series as well. We'll be putting it to work and overall enjoying it. Up next, we will be taking a look here at the NMC pickup truck. Now, this can also be found on console, which is pretty sweet. In the store, this can be found here under the cars category. Now, there is three options here for the NMC 1500, 2500, and 3500. I would assume it's just a little bit more power. Yeah, looks like a little bit more power here between them and probably can haul a bit more. Now, the one we'll be taking a look at, a deeper look at, is this one here. So, you guys can see it is pretty sweet here lots of different designs from bumpers uh, to uh, wow that's a really nice bumper here up next you do have a light bar you could get a, a beacon light really do like that a lot it's so cool to have pickup trucks on farm sim which is awesome for attachers you could also get a gooseneck a few different engine options a 5.7 liter v8 a 6.2 liter wow those are some pretty big engines and you do have a few steps on the side a few different rims as well if you guys want tone mirrors really do like the tow mirrors look at that and then the rims here you could even get a dually uh, configuration as we do take a full walk around you guys can see it is pretty sweet now this is on console mods are a bit limited you cannot have any new brands but i will have to say this is so cool very detailed and wow this thing looks awesome look at that suspension down below i really do like those wheels pretty simple design but it also does look great and wow it has a really nice stance really do like them coming out past the fenders and the little bit of a lift okay let's take a look here at all of the lights here they all do work here and look at those headlights wow that looks so so sweet now look at that we do have a full light bar up top there wow that's awesome up next we do have a working tailgate here with straps as well and we do have a full first person view look at all the detail here I will have to say the console mods are uh, some of the best ones that I've seen here for just kind of basic uh, no name brands but wow this is pretty awesome you guys can even see the brake pedal those all work down below there wow uh, this thing is just awesome really do like it quite a lot and I will be doing some Xbox uh, videos and possibly some Xbox uh, mod reviews uh, for all of you guys 
Up next here, we will be taking a look here at old classic Mustang. In this story, it can once again be found under the cars category. It's a 1965 $22,000. It only has uh, kind of these store uh, colors here. You do have a few different engine options, and you do have a few different stock options. Really do like those wheels. Uh, these are kind of the old classics, kind of like those, uh, but I really do like these here with the Ford Centers and the all-terrain uh, Goodyear tires. As we take a full walk around, you guys, since it is pretty sweet here, really do like this. I think there are a few other of these in Farm Sim, and this thing looks awesome here. Once we hop here on the inside, top suit, 142 miles per hour. Let's see, uh, brake lights, all of those lights do work here on it. Let's see, looks like we do have, uh, you can unfold it, so it looks like the trunk does fully function. Wow, that is pretty cool here. Let's see what else works on it and you could open up the door that is a pretty sweet feature and the door works let's see the other door and looks like we do have a working hoodie here so really do like all of those especially for out at a car show and things like that now looks like some of these are only kind of one way and I actually you guys can also see the windows do work here now that is pretty sweet now let's hop here on the first person view looks like we do have a working steering wheel pretty detailed wow look at the detail here in it wow this thing looks so uh, so sweet one of my favorite kind of uh, generations of, of the older Mustangs this thing looks awesome here now, if you guys do end up enjoying today's review, please drop a like. It's much appreciated as it helps out with the YouTube algorithms. Up next, we'll be taking a look here at a 2020 Cummins. Now, this is a Ram 2500 a Mega Cab here. Let's take a look at it here in the store. It's $67,400 uh, horsepower. You guys can see it does have quite a lot of colors. Now, it is. Uh, you could get some different wheels here on it. Now, you could go uh, with wheels, a few different ones that way as well. You do have a few attacher joints. Uh, let's see, gooseneck, drop neck. Uh, you do have a stock hood as well, which is nice. Now, up next, you could get chrome on the trim. You could get a stock bumper, upgraded bumper. Really do like that. You could get uh, color match, a lot of different things here on. As we continue, you could get fenders. Really do even color match fenders. Wow, that is pretty awesome. One of the best mega cabs I've seen here. Even color matching the grill. Wow, uh, you could color match around the grill, the uh, headlight housing. So many cool things. Let's see what else there is here and look that hood exhaust right through the hood and that is pretty awesome that is probably something that I have not seen here before you do have it here in the bed and so many other options as we do take a full walk around you guys and see I fully customize this one here look at the detail uh, down below here this front bumper looks great look at those wheels here really do like all the different wheels now this is a limited trim level as well and that back bumper this thing looks pretty sweet once we hop here on the inside top speed 130 miles per hour you can actually fold out those tow mirrors there which is pretty awesome let's look at all those headlights I will have to say the uh, Rams the Cummins that are in the game are some of the best ones here no working tailgate here which is okay and you actually do have lights there in the back look at those tow hooks really do wish those could be working there but once we hop here on the first first view we do have working mirrors it isn't too detailed here on the inside but I will have to say this thing looks pretty sweet here and a really nice Cummins uh, sounds I really do like featuring these reviews here showcasing some of the best pickup truck mods and other equipment mods but I really want to kind of get into more farming attachments, implements, uh, tractors and combines that's more of my goal going forward. Up next we'll be taking a look here at a 2020 Ram 5500. This is a regular cab with a flatbed with sides. Uh, this can be found here under the cars category. Has a starting price here of $45,000, 410 horsepower, and it is color changeable here. It does have quite a lot of a, a really nice detail here in the cab. As we do take a quick walk around, you guys can see this is pretty sweet here. Really do like the color changeable. Pretty nice flatbed. I'm not sure if I've seen this before here, but it does need a little bit more detail with uh, the lights there. But once we hop here on the inside, top speed is 75 miles per hour. And let's see, it looks like we do have something that works here. It looks like nothing works there. And we do have a few straps here on it, which is pretty nice. And all the uh, cab lights there does work here. Now on the first person view, it is somewhat detailed here. Wow, take a look. That very similar to the other uh, one, but this just has a 50 of uh, 500 badges on it. Maybe I will take these badges and put it on our dump truck uh, to become a 5500, but pretty sweet truck overall. 
Up next, we will be taking a look here at a 1993 Ford pickup. This can be found here under the cars category. Now, this is an extended cab long bed dually, uh, which is pretty awesome. It is color changeable here. Quite a few options if you want to do a two-tone, few things like that here as well. And you do have exhaust. Let's see what else is here. And you do have so many cool options as you go down here. Badges, chrome accents. Uh, you could get uh, different mirrors here on it. Lots and lots of different ones. And this thing is pretty sweet. As we do take a full walk around, you guys can see all the detail. It is at F350. I believe this is a 7.3. And a really, really nice. You guys can see the chrome wheels there on it. Look at this thing. Wow. Those huge uh, mud flaps down below is a nice touch. Once we hop here on the inside, you guys can see top speed is 75 miles per hour. Looks like we do have a working hood here on it. Wow, that is pretty awesome. Pretty cool uh, to have a detailed hood. I really do like that you could open up the hoods and see engine. And we do also have a working tailgate here, which is pretty neat. And on the first person view, working mirrors and steering wheel. Pretty detailed. Wow, this thing's awesome. I will have to say the mods keep getting better and better as the months continue. And I will have to say from the start of FS19 to now, the mods are incredible. Up next, we'll be taking a look here at a Toyota Tundra. This is a 2017 model with the crew cab in the six and a half foot bed. As we take a close look, $30,000, 400 horsepower, and it does have lots of new colors. You could do matte, you could do so many different ones, and you do have an option of bullet aftermarket wheels. Now, we don't have too many Toyotas here in the game. I think we only have two right now, which is awesome. Look at this thing. Wow, this thing does uh, look pretty sweet. Now, I will definitely have to put some aftermarket wheels and tires here on. Other than that, I will have to say this is pretty neat here. No working uh, lights here on the uh, back end. And some headlights do work here. Wow, this thing looks awesome. We'll take it here for a quick spin. Now, I hope everyone's been having a fantastic day so far. Let me know how it is down below. My day's been awesome. I've been working on a few homeworks, things like that. But it's nice to be back here, and reviews like these are some of my favorite things to do. And I can't wait to get a uh, farm some on the Xbox and even uh, get to doing some over there. Last up, we will be taking a look here at a few different mowers. You guys can see here, looks like we have a three-point and a hitch-mounted one. And those do look pretty nice here. All the links will be on my website with a post link down below. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more.